We were just a couple of ordinary kids wanting to move in together. Then everything changed. Things were getting really tense. And the virus was deadly. It's not just about living anymore. It's about surviving. But we can get through this, right? I mean, what's the Charles. worst that can happen? Oh my god. Is he, he infected? So I woke up pretty early today, it's about 1.30 p.m. And because I was a little hungry, I decided to go downstairs and get a little snack before going to bed for the rest of the day. Until I saw this. Oh my god. Let's do this. even used my bread. Sick. Nick? Are you serious right now? What? Like, are you serious? Do you not see the kitchen? Did you see the kitchen before you came downstairs? And I want you to recognize what it looks like right now. Like, seriously? He's so disrespectful, I can't stand him. He's the laziest person in the house, obviously, because you can see the way he dresses. He can't even do his hair properly. And yet he comes in after I cleaned, makes a sandwich using my bread. Sick. Looks like a pig style, are you for real? Barely, I just made a sign, what do you mean pig style? It's like not even messy. What do you mean? There's stuff all over the counter, you need to use my bread, dude. Don't touch me, okay? Your bread, hello? It's a community, hello, man. It's it's community. Community. Your, no, your bread is my bread, what do you mean? No, that's, that's what we're not gonna do, okay? Man, I don't even care if she cleaned up the kitchen, all right? I'm hungry, I need a sandwich, I need food, I'm a man. Is she gonna make me a sandwich? I don't think so. <sighs> Time is set. Is that 8.45 p.m.? I have to get up. I have to get up. Oh my god. <sighs> so it is day 55 of quarantine. Uh, things are getting a little tense. Tensions are at an all-time high. Where is everybody? Why is this place such a mess? Being locked inside this this house is really is really getting to us. Um, I just woke up. It's 9 p.m. So it's, sleep schedule has seen uh, better days, but I have a genius idea. I'm sick of everyone arguing. I'm sick of everyone fighting. So. We're gonna cook. We're gonna get together. We're gonna cook a nice wholesome family dinner, and I can't wait to see how it turns out Roommates assemble! Uh, I'm serious roommates uh, as assemble, please What's up Mike? 
Spoiling, let's uh, let's get some noodles on. Uh, do you know how much I should put? I don't know, dude. Yeah, All definitely it. necessary. Yeah, we don't we don't do we don't do pain here. Let's get it. Do you need help? So just the whole bag. Uh, like half. So just like the whole bag. Like half. Easy, easy. Yup. You're doing great. <laughs> what was that? You just sneeze? Nick? You good? When was the last time you left the house? I haven't left the house since this whole thing started. Well, you just sneeze. Like we just heard you sneeze. So. Hello? Not to the outside, bro. Just seasonal allergies. Don't worry, dude. Let's go. Let's get this thing cooking. Just seasonal allergies. Seasonal allergies. Right, 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 right. This man really thinks that I'm gonna believe allergies? Like, it is definitely not the season for allergies. Like, the, the way the virus spreads and the, how it's going around, like, this is not good. You will not catch me standing anywhere near that man for the next two weeks, especially if he goes outside. All right, mm -hmm. here we mm -hmm. go. Mm -hmm. it smells, uh, Amazing. I'll get the fourth. Good man, good man. See, wasn't this a good idea? We're bonding. Solid plan, all right. Let's eat. Take this. Mmm. Mm. Smells good. Not bad, not bad. So, what are we? Are you guys serious? What? You guys are making food for bonding time. And you guys couldn't even make me a plate? Is it in the microwave? Oh, you're joking. I literally can't believe them. They're so inconsiderate. I live with a bunch of animals. Do you have an explanation? Hey, Amen. You were no, upstairs you in your room. Okay, okay. and? There was 34 people living in this house. Four, Four. not three. We called so. for you. We called for you. You didn't show up. Okay, it's okay. This was your idea. I thought you wanted everyone to bond. There was a lot of tension in the house, right? It's not even that good. The disrespect is just so high in this house. It's just, it's giving me chills. It's not even good. It's, it's gonna not be a okay. point. Do you I, want some? Look, are you serious right now? Are you serious? This is what she gets. Man, Michael called all of us down. I heard it. Michelle heard it. Half the neighborhood heard it. To shower here? Probably. And then ignored it. All right. I don't know what she's talking about. Not getting some food. She is just trying to cause some drama. I swear. If I don't get out of this house soon. Me and shower, we're gonna start having some problems. No, I'm talking to you. I don't know why you're bringing him into this. This was your idea. You wanted everyone to be together okay. for our family best friend meal, and yet you didn't even make me a plate. How inconsiderate of you. I think I fucked up. 
we were supposed to bond all together as as roommates, but we didn't because Shara wasn't there. She's she's really mad at me, and I, I feel pretty bad because this is like the exact opposite of what I wanted. Things are debatably worse. How can I make it up to her? Wow, that was uh, that was pretty awkward, I gotta say. But you know, it, it bees like that. I I I'm literally gonna be carrying this house on my back when shit hits the fan. This virus thing is gonna go out of control. I just know it. And when it does, I need as much food in my system as possible to protect everybody here. So, sorry, Shire, if you're watching this at some point, uh, it has to be done. So in the middle of all of that rackets, I got a notification on my phone and apparently stuff is going down outside of this house and people are freaking out, including me, because as of tonight, I'm going to be doing hourly rounds outside, making sure none of those neighbors, I, I'm looking at all of you walking around, staring at the house, I know what they're looking for, I'm not letting a single one of them enter this house. So it turns out I can't stay up for 24 hours, so I thought maybe Nick would be kind enough to help me. Nick? Nick? Holy moly. Dude. Bro. Mm. Can you wake up? I'm getting a little tired of doing this shit, so could you like take over for me? Well, you better get out of here with that. Browns and night watch and shit. Bro thinks it's a freaking apocalypse out there. Get out of here, bro. So when we get raided, it's gonna be your fault. You know, Nick is gonna find it the hard way. He he thinks like sleeping during a time like this is okay. No, that ain't gonna cut it. When he finds all this food downstairs missing in the middle of the night, it's gonna be because of him, not me. Well, I'm sure Mike will uh, help since uh, Nick is useless. Mikey. Dude, it's your turn to go outside. I don't wanna. You're gonna take this? I don't wanna. Take the damn flashlight. I can't be outside all night. I need some sleep too. I... I'm so dumb. Do we even need to? Like, what's gonna happen? If I don't... <laughs> Do you know? You didn't know what's going on outside? <laughs> and are you? Dude, the neighbors are like literally outside, ready to attack us. Where's Nick? Can't Nick do it? He's my big brother. He can't, like, take this for me. You already know Nick is dumb. <laughs> Give me this. You got your own jacket. Just, just go. I hate it here! I hate the apocalypse! What a waste of my goddamn time. There was nothing out there. There were no zombies, there were no mercenaries, there were no angry neighbors, no bandits. There was literally nothing. Do you have any idea how cold it is out there? It's cold! Why did he make me do it? Why did he make me do it? Get these bags here. Still moving, huh?
Raiders? What do you mean Raiders? Oh, Raiders? What, what happened? They, they broke in. They broke in? Okay, dude, we gotta dude. go. We need to get the hell out of here. Let's go, let's go. Get him in, get him in. Okay. You okay? Everything's good? Yeah. Hey, what is going on? Why did we get raided? I thought you guys were supposed to be watching the house. So that, right now. This is not supposed to happen, guys. Shut up. Listen, Michelle is not feeling good. We're going to this house, okay? We're getting there. I'll show you guys that we're safe. At least we're all together and calm now. Just stay calm. Hey. Michelle, yo, stay with us, bro. Michelle, you got this, man. You're fine. Don't worry. Dude, Michelle, you okay? We're safe here, bro. We're safe here. Get the door. Get the door. Just get him to lie down or something. Oh, okay, big buddy. Oh. 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 I should probably get him some ice. Yeah, it's probably a good idea. Let's go. I don't even, I don't even know what to say right now. Everything just happened so fast. I feel like a complete and total failure. I was supposed to be watching my post and make, keeping everyone safe and I failed. Man, I actually cannot believe that Raiders would come into our house and break in. Like, that's absolutely insane. We were, we we're not safe in our own house anymore. But I do have to say, me and Jesse, we, uh, we handled ourselves pretty, pretty well. Fortunately, two other roommates couldn't do the same. There, there were two of them, I think. It was, it was really dark. And they just, they came out of nowhere. They, they, uh, they roughed me up pretty badly. Um, ah, yeah, I, I tried my best, you know, but they snuck up on me. What could I have done? Michelle? Yeah, hey, wait up. Let me help you. Michelle, you should be lying down right now. You need to stand, walk in. You know what happened? What the hell's the matter? What are you doing? Shut up, man. Come sit. Come, yes, yeah, sit down, sit down. You okay, Michelle? Okay. What the hell happened? I heard the raiders just barge into the house and I knew that they weren't one of us because everyone else was sleeping except for Michael and I didn't know what else to do so I just, I shut myself into my bathroom and I just hid. I wish I could help more but I know that I wouldn't have stood a chance so I just, froze and clearly that didn't do any help for anybody because Michelle ended up getting beat up. Michael was knocked out of the front door. It was just one of the most scariest experiences of my life. And thank God Jesse came when he did because who knows what would have happened if he didn't. So I was going outside because Michelle had got me to watch the house and it was dark and these guys came out of nowhere. They were wearing all black. I could barely even see them. And they and they jumped me. And then I don't really remember much. They must have like hit me in the head clearly and... Oh my god, dude. Yeah. I literally, I'm pretty sure I heard like all of the racks going on in the front and that's why I like came downstairs. And so like I went to the door, like I predicted, the raiders came uh, and yeah, I, I tried to fight them off as best I could but they, they outnumbered me because Mike was knocked out, Nick obviously wasn't on his post, and yeah, I got messed up and they started stealing everything. Man, all Nick had to do was go on his post. That's all he had to do and we, everything would have been fine. We wouldn't have been able to stop those raiders. I, I, ah. Oh my God. Okay, I know that obviously we are all super, super grateful that you got there in time, but Jesse, what the hell were you even doing there? Well, Long story short, okay, so I was walking my dog, Ollie, and this neighborhood, kind of just walking, strolling around, and I noticed the door of this house was wide open. And I was curious to why I would go in, there's nobody inside. It looked like somebody had abandoned the place. Like it was 
gone. Like everything was gone besides the furniture. And I was like, you know what? I could probably stay here. And so I was gonna call you guys. I'm like, hey, no one's picking up. I wanted to call you guys and let you guys know we got an open spot safe from Raiders. Nobody answered. So I just drove over there and literally driving out there, I saw Michelle getting kicked in the face. So I had to do something about it. I'm honestly just glad that I got there on time because if it wasn't for me, he would have been toast. Well, I'm glad that you showed up when you did. Clearly. No, seriously. We don't know what would have happened if you didn't show well, up. Well, everyone's safe. Everyone's good now. Thank God. So, welcome to our new home. New home, eh? This is the, the place we're gonna place be to staying, be. I guess. What should we call it? Why don't we call it quarantine house? <sighs> yeah, no, that's not so I, nope. I like it. Nick's um, just hating. Yeah, seriously, I think you're being a bit of a hater. Okay. So, welcome to the I quarantine think, I think house. It's good. It's good. Kind of has a ring to it. Yeah, it's good. I'm not gonna lie. Quarantine house has a really good ring to it. I, I think Nick is just a hater. Quarantine house? Bro, I still think that name is lame as fuck. Yep. So with all that being said, go pick your rooms. I already have my room. I already bled everywhere inside of it. So, so I guess that room's taken. But there are two rooms upstairs, so. Okay, no Nope! Back, back! Get off, Nick! No, my dog isn't right here! No, you don't need it! I need the one that's right here in the bathroom, okay? Oh, you can see it from the last time! No, that doesn't make any sense! No, 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 wants to argue with me over what room we get. He can't just let me have my room. I don't know why this guy feels just so entitled to get anything that he wants, but I got to the room first, so therefore it's mine. And honestly, being in front of the room that has the bathroom right in front of it helps me because I'm just so terrified that if we ever get raided again, I know I'm gonna wanna go straight to the bathroom like I did the last time. And I don't know why Nick can't just see that and just let me have it. Well, I'm glad I woke up in the bed that I did because everyone seems to be fighting over those two rooms and I got one of the biggest rooms in the house, so... Sucks to suck. Two minutes until it's moving into this new house. Shower's already pissing me off. Dude, that was my room. I wanted the room next to the bathroom. Now I'm stuck with this trash room right also next to the bathroom, but it doesn't matter, okay? I wanted that one. She ended up with it. Good job. You good? Yeah, I guess I'll just, like, I'll just sleep on the couch or what? What? No. No. I have a room for you, man. I have, I have just the room really? for you. You're the man, man. Come on. Let me show you. Really? That's awesome. This is a, this is your room. This is, this is what, is it like a closet? No, what? this is the closet. This is your room. It's right at the front of the house. Come on, man. What's wrong? You gotta be kidding me. It's nice, isn't it? Better be good. No, you're kidding, right? Uh, I'm not quite sure how this happened, but I definitely have the worst room in the house. It's small. Uh, there's a giant window that cover. You can see directly into my room. It's right beside the front door, which I know can easily be broken into, and I don't want this to happen again. I don't want this to happen ever again. What do you think, bro? First of all, it's right beside the front door. If a raider comes in, who's gonna be the first to get attacked? He's not gonna go, he's gonna come right in here and kill me. Not only that, I'm not done. There's a giant window. Yeah. I have no privacy and yeah. somebody could just break through the window and again attack me. This is the worst room in the house. Okay, listen. I noticed when everyone was celebrating that Michael didn't seem too happy. So I asked him why and he was kind of like, he just didn't like his room, but I had it. Your door locks, one. Okay. Two, the entire room covered with, listen to this, bulletproof glass. Yep. Bulletproof? And on top of that, on top of that, the windows, they're barred. Nobody's going through those. Okay. Okay. Got this for you. Security docks. Yep. I did anything for you, bro. I'm telling you. So this, I'm safe you're here. Safe, you're safe at the house in the house, bro. I got you. Okay? I'm oh, thanks, man. Me. I think I judged my room a little harshly, and after speaking with Jesse, he actually made me feel better. I told him there was bulletproof glass. 
I told them there were bars on the windows and I told them that there were security dogs. I obviously lied. We all know that if we get raided, he's gonna be the first one to go, no matter what happens. Okay, I think it would be best if we made up some rules or whatever since we're gonna be surviving together from now on. What do you guys think? Um, well, good. we had rules before and people just didn't want to follow them. Um, I'm not putting any names out there, but uh... Just say it, man! Say it! I know what you're trying to say! Just say it! Stop dancing around it, bro! Well, I mean, Nicholas, none of this would have ever happened if you went to your post just like I told you. I don't know why everyone's asking me to make any of these rules because, I mean, if you look at my face, um, it didn't turn out so well last time, so... If, if no one's gonna follow the rules I put in place, then there's no point. We're, we're just all gonna be here for a couple days and then another raider's gonna show up and steal all our stuff. And now look, what happened to Mike? He got knocked out, He and we got raided, and now we're in this random house that we don't even know who lives here. Well, guess what? I think I like this house better. I think it's worse that you guys got jumped and maybe a little of our okay, things got okay, stolen. Okay, okay, just so we can okay, end okay, up okay, in okay, okay, stop. What the hell is wrong with you guys? This Calm guy is crazy. Down. I'm saying we guys, out. It's fine. Let it go. Sure, what were we saying? Thanks, Jess. Okay. Um. Everyone good now? Yeah. I don't know what he wants from me. I was tired. I'm not getting up out of my bed to look around the house in case something happened. I mean, something ended up happening, but what are the chances? Like, nothing should have went wrong. Again. He keeps acting up, man. Me and Michelle, we're gonna have some problems. Well, that was awkward. Um, but at the same time, did Michelle lie though? <sighs> That's all I have to say. And Nick, if you're watching this right now, you better be following these damn rules this time because that can't happen ever again. I'm really worried that the tension between Michelle and Nick don't affect anything, especially when everyone's doing their rounds. Michelle, you keep acting up, bro. Calling me out like that, you're gonna end up with another black guy. Promise you that. All right, well, this isn't really my area of expertise, so even though this is kind of heated or whatever, I'm gonna give you the mic, Michelle, since you know how to prepare us the most. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, first of all, uh, we're gonna have shifts that people are going to show up to. Um, and we could all do it probably by ourselves, except obviously Michael, since uh, you clearly don't know how to protect yourself against more than one person. So you and Shara- Can we just see. not uh, talk about that for like a bit? Let me like deal with this. Oh yeah, you you went through the struggle. And I you, did. You clearly are a lot more- Have you up. seen my face, bro? Have you seen my face? I am getting sick and tired of hearing about how I allegedly knocked out while on my post because two people who are cowards snuck up and attacked me. It's frustrating. We everyone knows what happened. I know what happened. We we're all we're all on the same page. So why do people keep on bringing it up? I don't know. It's never going to happen again. Thank God because my girl Shira is my new guard duty partner, which I am excited for. I just want to put this out here. Uh real quick. We were able to defend ourselves. Yep. Okay. Help. 2 versus 2. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I'll have my shift and you two will have your shifts uh, and then these two will be together. Okay, I think that's fair. Okay, well, what about food? What do you think? Um, like, do we have to go out or anything the soon? The house should be stopped for a bit, but we're going to have to go eventually. Jesus. When you almost die, things kind of get put into perspective. You, you see more clearly. And due to my near-death experience, I realized that I never apologized to Shira for leaving her out of the cooking. So I am going to go do that. Shira, I've had a near-death experience. It's put a lot of things into perspective. Okay. And I realized that if I did die back then, I wouldn't have been able to apologize. So for I'm going to... For, for getting you for the dinner. Remember when we made pasta and- Oh right, when you excluded me. Yeah, yeah I yeah, honestly, that was that such- That makes a lot of sense, yeah, thanks for that. It was such an awful thing to do. It was just terrible. And it wasn't my fault. It was Nick's fault. Really? 
Yeah, I had. But it was your idea. It was it, Nick's fault. It was Nick's fault. It was there's no fault to be had. I'm basically apologizing for Nick. <laughs> My fault, huh? Oh, what? Are you, what are you? What are you talking about? So this is this is what we're doing today. I, it's uh. Oh, hold up. Wait. One sec. Is it? Ah. Blame Nick Day! Well, I didn't realize that. I don't know Crazy. what you're talking about. Nick Crazy! Well, I mean, First it not blame your Michelle Blame. No, I was- Now Mike's Blame. I was just apologizing to Shire. Are you lying? About what? Guys, guys, like, guys, actually... guys, guys, no. guys, 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 stop, stop, stop. It's not worth it. It's been a long day. Exactly. Can so we all just get along? Right. And try to survive this together. Mm -hmm. Team, just go to bed. Mm -hmm. Bed sounds good. And then I agree. refresh in the morning. On, mm -hmm. Everything. on our faults. Well, that didn't go good. Nick walked in right as I was lying to Shara's face about the food and who excluded her from making it. Not a good look. Hello? Hey. So, I've been, um, Looking through the stock, and it seems like we're kind of running out of things. I thought we had enough supplies to last us a while, but uh, I was wrong, and now we have to go out and get more. Oh, oh no. Wait, what does that mean? We're gonna have to go make a run and pick up some supplies. Wait, we? Yeah. Yeah. Count me um, out. I think I left something in the oven or something. I shot not. I'm not going. Shot not as well. I have yeah. So. Yeah, I'm just. What? Well, you know what? Thank God. Thank God. Uh, Nick? Wait, what's happening? Um, we are going to get some supplies at uh, the store. I miscalculated. Okay. Are you sure that I have to come? Yes, you're the only person who's brave enough to come. Could you please come? <sighs> okay, yeah. That's good. Okay, well, um, I say we go at night. I think it's a little bit more safer, less people out. Probably a good idea. Okay, and uh, some paper towel, yep. Looks good. Pretty solid amount, right? Looks like that's it, right? That's all we needed. Toilet paper, paper towel. I think that's good, yeah. I feel like there's something more we could really get. All right, let's uh, let's get out of here. Yeah. Okay, that wasn't okay. That wasn't that good was, at all. That was no. That, that was, was really scary, right? Bad, bro. What the hell? Okay, um, well, just, just let's keep it between us. Okay, yeah. No, the the, the, the rest of the house, like, they'll freak out if they find out. That's what I'm saying. So if we just keep it on the down low, okay. but what happened, right? Nothing. No, nothing. Nothing at all happened, bro. I think exactly. We'll, we'll be fine. Yeah. Let's just, let's just go back. Bro, what is happening? First, we get our house broken into. Then we get jumped in the parking lot. That was a very close call. I'm glad we escaped that thing. Whatever the hell that was. What is this world coming to? I will say though, probably a good idea that we don't tell the rest of the roommates about what just happened in case they all decide to panic. They're all, you know, not as tough as me, but what they don't know definitely can't hurt them. I had no choice. I, I had to convince Nick to not tell the others because everyone's already freaking out. There's not much more I can do to make them feel safe. So I had no choice. And what does it matter? I didn't even, I didn't even get hurt. Get there. Ooh, supplies! We're here, baby. Yeah, we're good. Quick. We're nice and safe. Here, yeah, I'll grab my 
Look at all this toilet paper. Ooh. You guys got a lot of stuff. Good work. How was the trip? It was good. Yeah, it was good. Anything weird happened? How was outside? No, it was just uh, cold. Very, very cold. Yeah, it was, uh, it was, it was interesting. It was very interesting. Nothing, nothing weird happened. Shira, can you come down? Shira? Shira, can you come down? Yeah. Yeah, what's up? Uh, I just wanted to kind of talk about my apology that I made to you. The really shitty one you mean? Yeah, I feel like I didn't really apologize for what I did, I just blamed Nick. Mm -hmm. So I want to re-apologize. And I also have two questions for you. All right, so my first question, Shira, is are you hungry? And my second question is, if you are, do you want to eat with me? Yeah, sure. Yes, okay, let's go, let's come. It's super weird seeing Mike act so nice, but I mean, you know, like I'll play along as long as I get the free food out of it. The last apology I gave Shira was pretty terrible, so I figured Maybe I'll give her an actual apology, you know, own up to my mistakes, and I'm gonna give her food. I'm gonna offer to make her food. Woman love food. I think it'll work great. Plus, I do owe her since I kind of left her out the last time. Mmm. Mmm. This is so good. Oh my god. Gus. What? Have you guys noticed What's up? that Jesse is acting like really weird right now? Mm -hmm. He's not talking to her. What's this? What's going on here? Um, uh, Mike wanted to make some food. Yeah, we're just eating. Okay, doesn't matter right now. Thanks for the invite. Jess is acting really, really weird and it's super, super sus. Like, he's not talking to anyone. He's like, he looks really weird and he's you're not leaving his room. You're overthinking it. Just take a chill pill. It's not that big of a deal. Dude, it's a pandemic. We need to know what's going on with Jesse. Like, he came back from Walmart and Nick's been acting perfectly normal for some reason. After Walmart, Jesse's been acting super sus and it's getting really, really weird. Yeah, he's not wrong. Jesse has been acting kind of weird. Like you would expect that he would want to hang out with his friends since he's been in this house alone this whole time, you know? And we just got together the other day, so I don't know why he would stay in his room all day and not even come out. I mean, I guess it's kind of sus, but I don't know. It's not a big deal, I don't think. Have you seen him walking around here eating anything? He hasn't been in the kitchen once. Yeah, I, don't, I haven't seen him come out of his room since the other night. I haven't either, that's a good one. Well, have you spoken with Nick about this yet? No. Why? He's been really annoying, so I kind of just wanted to stay away from him, but I guess... Uh, this is kind of important. Yeah, so you, you should, should talk to him. If you're feeling this talk. sus about it, yeah, you should probably just go have a little chat with him. I think he's in his room. I'll keep you guys posted? Yep. I'm glad we'll be here. So ever since Jesse came back from Walmart, things have been kind of weird. I've been hearing like strange noises coming from his room. I can't tell if it's like puking or like he's just like yelling at something. I don't know, something is going on in there and it's, it's getting really, really weird. I'm just hoping that he's okay. And honestly, if he's infected, then no, he can't be infected. After Jesse got home from the Walmart trip with Nick, he's been acting weird. He went into the bathroom and then just went straight up to his room and didn't talk or come back down and say anything to anybody. And you would just think since he's been in this house the whole time by himself that he would want to be with his friends after finally reuniting with us, but I guess not. I don't know, I hope he's okay. Maybe he just got a bug or something. Jesse's been acting really weird lately. After he came back from Walmart, he just went right to his room and I haven't seen him since. It's been like hours and hours and he just hasn't left. It's kind of weird, but I think he just might be tired. I don't know. <sighs> I really, really do not want to go up to the next room and talk to him about what happened because I know I'm just going to walk up in there and he's going to be like, I don't know what happened. And I'm going to be like, Nick, you just need to tell me what's going on. I know something's up. And he's just going to blow it off like it's nothing. 
And I know this is a new house and all, but if I gotta be the one that gets everyone in check. And if Nick's not in line, I'm gonna have to cut him out. Listen, I know we have our differences. Okay. We yeah. haven't been agreeing, but I need to know what happened at Walmart. Because Jesse over here, he's acting real weird. Walmart? Like the, the, the trip, the, you, the you Walmart went out. run? Yeah, you Dude, came back. To... Nothing happened, bro, nothing. We just, we got our stuff, we got it. Come on, there's something happened. Jesse's acting <laughs> weird, you're acting like nothing happened, like. Yeah, I'm acting like nothing happened because nothing happened. Jesse is acting weird because he's freaking weird, dude. Like, what? How does that make any sense, man? He's just, he's acting weird ever since the trip. There's gotta be something that happened that you're just not saying. Just say it and I'll be on my way. Okay, listen here, uh, Mr. End of the World preparation guy. I know you want something to be happening. Nothing's happening, okay? We're laying low. This is, this is it. All we have to do is stay inside, hunker down. We're gonna get through this. Relax, okay? I'm watching you. No. I'm watching you. Good luck with that. I need that guy. Okay, that was really, really weird and a super, super close call, but I'm pretty sure I played it pretty cool. Hopefully, he's not on to me. And hopefully, hopefully, if we're lucky, they never find out what happened when I went to Walmart. So with everything going on, I think it's kind of weird that Nick is just acting like everything's okay, when clearly nothing is okay. So Nick has to be hiding something. He, he's got to. And I'm gonna find out what it is. You look so angry. Something's going on. He knows something, and he's just not saying it. With what? Something happened at Walmart. I'm telling you, something happened at Walmart. My survival instincts are popping off right now. Okay. Something's up. What do you think happened? Well, it doesn't matter, because even if they're acting sus, we can't act weird around them, because that'll make us look sus. So let's everyone just take a step back, keep our cool until tonight. Jesse's watch is tonight, right? Yeah. Okay, then, so we'll just wait until he comes out then and see if he's acting super weird. Because we can't go pointing fingers. Like you said, it's a pandemic. Anything weird is sus, so we don't want to be the ones acting sus, right? I agree. Okay, I guess I'll find something else to do and take my mind off this. Okay, just don't, breathe. Don't stress about it too breath. much until we see, like, full proof. Right, so if you see anything, you come to me. You got it? I'm okay. good. No worries. <sighs> this guy is stressed. Is he good? Is he gonna be okay? I don't think so. I don't know, but we'll see. Okay, so it is definitely weird that Jesse and Nick are acting sus because they are the only ones that went to Walmart, but I am crossing my fingers and hopefully this is just a huge misunderstanding. Something just doesn't feel right. I don't see why my own brother would be acting sus and hiding secrets from me. Like. We're, we're family, we're supposed to be able to tell each other anything. It really just makes me feel uncomfortable. Okay, well at least we don't have to do a shift tonight. Mmm, yes we do. We're together. Tonight, Dingus. Oh, sorry, You're right. Thank God. Thank God. Okay, but I have something that we can do. What? To uh, waste the time away. We... Video games. No, we yeah. should... No. I think that since we're living here, this house deserves some TLC because it's a little crazy, so. The loneliest cobra. No, some tender love and care. So, we're gonna clean. No, no. no. Last time I checked, you were apologizing to me. You don't have a choice. If we, if I help you clean, are we even? Yeah. Promise. Bing. All right, let's go. Let's go. Down here the whole time. Just uh, cleaning 
working incredibly hard to get this whole house a spick and span. Ugh. Okay, well, we need to go. Check up on him? Yeah. Okay. Because it's getting a little weird, and I think it's time to, to get to the bottom of this. Should we go get Nick then? I don't think that's good. Yeah. It's, uh, he's acting way too weird, and I think he's trying to cover up something, so let's just ignore him. Get to Jesse. First things first, I guess. All right, let's do it. Let's see what happens. Jesse? He's infected. What? Something's wrong with Jesse. Something's he's like, wrong. he's he looks all messed what up. What do you mean he something's is... wrong? He looks messed up. Are you sure? Are you sure? Is he telling lies again? No. He was sick. Maddie was there taking care of him for some reason. I don't even know how she got here. He looks in terrible condition, and then he like attacked us. It's something's yeah. wrong with me. All the only it. person who was lying is you. So what, what happened, happened at Walmart? Tell us the truth. Nothing happened at Walmart. We got in. We got our stuff. We left, and then. We, Dude, we know you're lying, man. We know you're lying. Just say what happened. There, nothing happened. We came in. You guys are overreacting. Nick. Clearly overreacting. Nick, tell us the truth. What happened at Walmart? You're my brother. You can't be lying to me. Okay. Maybe something happened. I fucking oh knew my it. God. I fucking knew it. What happened? What? It what was happened? nothing. Why would you lie? We have no room for lies right now. Who's there? I thought I heard something. Anyways, he lied to us. He lied to me, he lied to Michelle, he lied to Shira, he lied to every single one of us. He put us in danger when he didn't tell us the truth. And even worse, Jesse's infected, or he might be. What are we gonna do? This is exactly why we don't keep secrets in the house. Exactly for this reason. <sighs> what did I say? I was right the whole time. We're leaving through the parking lot and some random like homeless person or something came and attacked us attacked? and we pushed them off and then Are what? That's all that happened. And that's not something you thought you should share with the group. You put us all in danger oh by not telling us. Oh my god. All of us in danger. Hey, listen. We were all just attacked the other day and none of us are sick. So I didn't think it was a big deal. You know, like. So why were you hiding it? Why were you, why couldn't you just say it? We got attacked by a dude. If it's not a big deal. Because you're sensitive, you think this is the end of the world, and you're just an idiot. So, nice. You nice. guys can't handle it. This is not the time to nice. making jokes. Okay, okay. Are, are there any other secrets that you want to Since you're hiding here? so many things, anything else? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, the last bag of Skittles at Walmart? I purchased, and none of you guys can have them. All right, so we got a jokester in the room. Okay, okay. so can we all not. agree to not have any more secrets from now, from now on. on? Agreed. Jesse? Oh, Maddie, what are you doing here? Jesse called me because he said he was feeling sick, and he needs me to take care of him. Feeling sick? Yeah. We think that there's something wrong with Jesse, so is... Is everything okay? Yeah, he's totally normal. He just feels sick. normal. Did you not see what happened? He was like yelling at us and he panting and sweating. Yeah. Did he's you see dead. him, Maddie? He he's almost dead. attacked us. He literally attacked us. That's stress. Stress. Stress from what? What, what, what does he from do? From filming. From working. Just like I don't know, man. I've seen Jesse stress. He didn't look stressed. He so looks weird. odd. Just like different. So basically, Jesse texted me because he was feeling sick. Um, he asked me to come over. To help him and to take care of him and I know everyone thinks that he's infected but 
he's fine like that's just how he acts when he's sick and he's fine that's just him okay wait was there anything else like did you notice anything other weird he stuff had about him a rash on his arm but he wouldn't let me look at it a rash so he's infected he must be a rash? That's probably what happened when he got attacked. Yeah, he got. Did some... you see a rash, Nick? When like you no, know, he just we nudged off the person, and then we left. This is crazy. Are you sure it's there's a rash? It's starting to make so much sense right now. Okay, so he must have been like infected when they were at Walmart, and then he has and this that's rash. That's why he's been acting so strange. There's no way he has the virus. Did, did you get attacked? There's no way he doesn't have the virus. I don't know, man. Wait, it's like... stop. What was that? Did you hear that, Jesse? What? What? What's he doing? Jesse? Jesse? Max, be careful. Back away! Jesse, what's going on? Max, just come back, just come back. This is. Just come back, come back. This is not safe! What happened to your arm, Jesse? Tell us what happened at Walmart. Your hair is literally changing colors, dude. I tried to hide it. What? I got bit. What? Bro. Okay, it's, it's okay, Jess. We can, we can fix this. Come on, just get back into your room. Everything's not okay. It's too dangerous. Okay, Maddox, back We're gonna, gonna fix this. We're gonna fix this, okay? Jesse, just stay over there. We're gonna find a cure. Je what the hell? Jesse? Are you okay? Is he breathing? Okay. Jesse! He yeah. just passed out. He's going to the balls. <laughs> what? How's he breathing right now? Jesse? Oh my god. I don't understand. Okay, okay, I don't like this. Back up, back up. Back up. Back up. Not making any noise. Oh, I really wish she was just sick right now. What do we do? Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Shh, shh, shh. Grab your light. Wait, one sec. Let me get the, get the camera. Get the light. What the hell is going on, guys? Either Jesse's some kind of like zombie genius, or the power just went out randomly. So. At the worst time. Perfect. What? How would he cut the power? What does that? That doesn't, it literally yeah, that doesn't, doesn't matter right now. We need to figure out a plan. Mm -hmm. Jesse's infected. We know you get bit. Get infected. Okay. We need to somehow like get him in like a secure location, and that's our. That's the Where? Only Where is the most secure place in this house right now? Because if anything, we need to secure our safety, not his. So. But we don't even know where he is. Um, so well, we don't know where he is, and we need somewhere for him to go. So what's the plan, Michelle? I think we need to get him in the basement. We find him. Uh, are there? Does anyone know where any of the weapons are? They've been missing for like days. Now. I don't think. Yeah, this is completely them. random, and it's only because I'm paranoid, so nobody judge me. But I have a bunch of weapons in my room, just in case of emergencies. You have all these. You've been time. this whole time. I've been scared that all something was gonna happen, and who knew that the okay, imposter was gonna be in our house? Okay, so okay. everyone grab one. Okay, go for it, Jesse. We're gonna have to split up into teams, okay, guys? Okay. Man, this is so messed up. Shira and me are gonna go in the basement. If Jesse's there, we can just lock him in there. Okay. Be good. You three. Check the upstairs. Check Jesse's room. Check your room. Okay. Check okay. the whole top floor. And if everything's, Mike, Mike, are you okay, dude? I'm okay, man. Just snap out of it, man. What? We need to save Jesse. This is not the time to have it? panic meltdowns right now. Just... Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Pull your shit together. This is really scary. Okay. Now's not the time to be freaking out. Okay. All we have to do is go look at all of us. We're all strong dudes, right? We do got this. this. Do that. I'll stay in the back though. Nick? This guy. You need to take it serious. You guys ready? Yeah. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. See anything? 
Jesse? No, I don't see anything right now. Jesse? Jesse, are you in here? Okay, be very quiet. Jesse? Jesse, we're here to help. I don't see him yet. I don't even know. There's there's no way to even open it. Did he just cut all the wires? I don't know, maybe. No, they're all cut. Literally all cut. Oh my god. Why would he do that? Do you think he would have done this on purpose? Or it's uh, just... This doesn't look like anyone could have done something like this. That's super weird. Okay, let's just keep, keep looking. looking around. Jesse? Jesse? Okay, so he's definitely not in the basement. Okay, let's let's meet with the others. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Jesse's not in the basement. Basement's clear. Let's go upstairs. Let's meet with the others. Ah! Oh, oh. What the hell? What's going on? Yeah. Let him out. Let him out. Let him out. Let him out. Jesse, calm down. You have to. Jesse, they, no. They, they found Jesse. Oh, oh my God. Guys. Guys. Stop. What's going on? Guys, we have Jesse trapped. We have Jesse trapped. Wait, wait. Where's Madison? Where, where's he got her? What? She's gone, man. She's gone. What? He freaking got her, man. Help us. We gotta do something. Jesse, stop. Okay. Whoa. Uh, he, he's trapped in there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I think he, he's trapped. Then we're he's fine. Trapped. Then we're fine. What? We're, we're fine. Okay. Well, he's gonna. He's he's a zombie. Zombie. We can't just stay in. He's a zombie. How is he gonna open the door? He's. We can feel him twisting the door. Yeah. We need to think of something, man. Okay. Stop, well, Jesse. Calm down. Thing. How are we gonna capture him? Are you guys okay? Like. Yeah, we're. we're dude, we need to think. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. Is he? He stopped. Okay, okay. I don't, I don't. Okay, what, what do we do? Okay, well, we need to figure. We need to figure out a way to trap him. Like, hurry, hurry, man! What, 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 what? Get a blanket. Somebody get a blanket. Okay, okay let's go get something. Come, Michelle. There's one in my room. Hurry, hurry! Oh my God! Jesse, no. You guys have it? Got it. Yeah, we got, we got, we got. Okay, what do we do? What do we do, Shark? Okay. Okay, so you're gonna open the door. Yeah. Come run towards me. Okay. Open the door. Yeah, you're gonna open the door and come to run towards me. Okay. Okay, on three. One, two, three. Come here, Jesse. Jesse. It's, it's okay, bro. Just, just come out. We can talk. Michelle, in three, two, one. Go. Get down! Get down! We got him! Get him! We got him! Jesse, just calm down. Just calm down. Nick, are you okay? What the hell? Nick, 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 Is he breathing? He's... What the hell is going on? He's not breathing. Ah. He needed to do something about Jesse. We need to knock him out or something. Ah. 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 Let's get him to the bathroom or something. We can't just be lying here around in case he wakes up. He's not breathing. What? What happened? Did he just fall down? I don't know, man. He's not okay. breathing. Just, something wrong just give us a second so we can get rid of this body. Okay, what's going on with him? Okay. What? Wait, what the hell? Dude, Shara, look at this. Oh my god. What Is he, he infected? Just no him. There's no way. Well, what? did you see anything? Like when he got Maddie? What does that mean, though? Wait. What's happening? Nick! Nick! Nick, Nick, come on! Fight it! You have to fight it, Nick! Please! Nick! No, no, Nick! No, Mike, no, Nick! Back off. No, back off. my brother, Nick! Mike! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get Get away! Oh my god, did you guys see that? Michelle literally just jumped in the way from Nick trying to get to me. Why did he have to do that? Well, maybe he didn't get bit, right? I didn't, I mean, I didn't see any blood. I didn't even see a cut or anything. I just saw him jump right in the way. Everything just happened so fast. Okay, guys, I'm in the basement right now, and I don't even think there's any weapons down here for me to use to protect myself, but I need a plan. What do I do? Oh my god, think, think shy. Okay, I'm in the basement. There are zombies everywhere in our house right now. And I don't know if Michelle's fully bit or transforming and turning into a zombie, I don't know. But what I do know is that I need to go get help. So hopefully I can save myself and Michelle. But where are we gonna get this help? Oh, the window. Is it locked? Yes! 
Alright, so thank God for some good news. The window opened, so now I have a way to escape, but... Damn it. The only problem is we don't have any gates on either side of the house, so that means I literally have to go through the house to get outside. Hopefully everybody just left the living room so I won't get caught and they won't try to attack me or anything like that, but there's only one way to find out. Alright guys, it's time to do some climbing. Anybody, so that's a good sign. Here we go. Michelle, oh my god. Are you okay? Come on, we have to get out of here. You have to come with me. You have to come with me. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Michelle. You can't I can't just leave you here. Okay, we have to go get we have to go to safety. We have to go through the front door. Michelle, you can't just leave me. You can't. I'm gonna come back for you. Okay, I just gotta get outside. Ah! Hey, get off me! Get off me! Oh no, oh no. I gotta go to the basement. No! Nick, get away from me, Nick! What the hell? In the laundry room. Okay, okay, so calm down. Are you good? You've been here. Are you infected? You've been sleeping all the week. Shara, we mean I'm infected. Shara, you are infected right now, okay? You're infected? You need to calm down? Oh, I feel awful right now. What's, what's I need happening? water. Someone bring water, please. Okay, Shara, the doctor says everything will be okay as long as you stay in bed and you just, you just rest, okay? How long have I been here? It's not this whole time. It's been a week, Shara. I've been in bed for a week. You've been in bed for a week. You have the virus. The doctor says you have very vivid dreams. So it might have been what you're thinking of right now, but you've been here for a whole week, okay? Oh my god. Bro. Last thing I remember is everyone was turning into a zombie or I don't know what they were, but we'll just call them zombies and Maddie literally just attacked me. It's okay, just lie down. I'm gonna get you some water. Everything will be okay. Okay? 